Hey Pisces, welcome back guys. So let's go ahead and see what's coming towards you in love. Let's tap into this energy. See what are the overall messages that you need to know. Things that you would need to be prepared for. And what are the outcomes of these messages. But before we get started guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, these readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. If the reading resonated and you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The information is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. All right, guys, let's go ahead and see what are your overall messages and love. Guys, keep in mind, this could be for new love or this can be for someone coming back towards you. Just take the messages that resonate and as always, leave the rest behind. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians, please help me give Pisces clear and concise messages regarding their situations in love. What is going on with my Pisces in love? What is coming towards Pisces universe? I have vibrations. So there is an energy here of things are starting to change for you, Pisces. I feel like you've been in an energy where you've just been spending some time by yourself, you know, trying to figure things out. After a time of deception, you may have been in a situation with someone who could have been a deceptive individual. You've been spending some time healing that energy, trying to figure out what you want to do moving forward. And basically just doing things different in your life. For a lot of years, or for a, lot, a long time, Pisces, you've been in this energy where you're always looking out for everyone else, but you stop looking out for yourself. And in this overall energy here, Pisces, is you refocusing again. Focusing on you, focusing on your happiness, focusing on your abundance. Just focusing on what makes you Pisces. What makes you a better person, not only for yourself, but those that you love. And then I have fresh start. Pisces, as you're coming out of this energy where you have started looking at things different, you're closing out cycles here with conclusion. You're coming out of this paused energy, and it's because you've been very patient with yourself. There's also an energy of coming back around towards your family and recognition, knowing that you are loved and deserve to be loved by others adored by others, recognized by others. You've been spending a lot of time by yourself with patience and, and, and pause here. I see you possibly spending a lot of time with your family because you've been closing out a cycle here in a situation where, you know, you no longer may find yourself in that relationship anymore or, or you just may no longer find yourself wanting to entertain that individual anymore. Let's see here. Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians, please help me give Pisces clear and concise messages. What happened with Pisces in the recent past? What is the overall energy with Pisces in the recent past universe? I have the Six of Pentacles energy, and I have the Devil here. Pisces, you were in a situation where you were trying to have an equal give and take with someone who was toxic. This individual in the past did not recognize your efforts or recognize your energy or even gave you the respect that you dis they, that you required and desired. You were giving this person all of you while they were possibly running the streets and doing whatever it is that they wanted to do here. And with the Three of Swords, as you continued working on this connection, this person continued breaking your heart, possibly even putting you in third-party situations. You started looking at this situation as a very burdening relationship. Even though you had a lot of love for this person, you started looking at yourself as ending these cycles with this individual. Things were not changing. You were holding on to a situation that was continuously being toxic, a person that was being very toxic, living in their ego, being very arrogant, and you chose to walk away from a situation here. There you go, Eight of Cups, Pisces. You walked away from a relationship that was very toxic, a relationship that brought you a lot of burdens, a lot of heartache, and a lot of anxiety. Pisces, you decided to take a different direction here. You decided to, again, focus on you, have a fresh start, do things different because the situation that you were dealing with became too burdening for you. What is the overall energy right now for Pisces Universe? What is the current energy for my Pisces, please? eight of pentacles you're rebuilding okay you're letting go of anxieties you're letting go of drama you're letting go of unnecessary um, an, um sorry guys 
of unnecessary drama. You're rebuilding a stronger foundation for yourself. And as you're doing all these things, Pisces, little do you know what's getting ready to come towards you is a new beginning in love. You may feel lonely here with the seven of pentacles in the reverse, but you do, you do not expect what's coming towards you, Pisces. It's a wish fulfillment, okay? As you're, go, as you're walking away from a situation that just did not serve a purpose for you, as you left a relationship that was becoming more painful and burdening as the days went on, you decided to move towards something more abundant. And it wasn't to another relationship. It was a relationship with yourself. It was self-love. It was self-acceptance. It was self-respect. You moved away from someone who caused you a lot of pain, someone who caused you a lot of anxiety, and you decided to rebuild a new life for yourself. You opened up your own path. You were truthful with yourself. You even acknowledged the fact that you were not happy in this situation because this person was emotionally conflicted. Seven of, of Cups in the reverse, this is someone who constantly would tell you one minute, I love you, I want to be with you, and the next minute, oh, I can't stand you. You know what? I don't want nothing to do with you. So you just ultimately decided to close out that cycle with that individual. But in your current energy now is that you're preparing for something that you don't even have any knowledge of what's coming towards you, Pisces. There's a new beginning in love here. This person is ultimately going to be the wish fulfillment that you've always desired. This individual that's going to come in here, you may be dealing with a fire sign here. But somebody who's going to be very passionate about you, very passionate about this connection, and very passionate about obtaining something big with you, having, um, uh, having equal give and take, having the opportunity to bring peace, harmony, and balance in this situation. With the Page of Wands, definitely someone new coming in. Like I stated, it could be a fire sign here. But this person, Five of Wands in the reverse, they have no necessity to come in here and fight with you. On the contrary, Pisces. We are very emotionally inclined individuals, spiritual individuals, and this person is going to know how to work with the Pisces that you are. They're going to be romantic. They're going to treat you like an empress. They're not going to find the necessity to fight with you or to make you feel abandoned. On the contrary, with the hermit here, this person is going to be very spiritually available to you, emotionally available to you, and it was because this person was divinely guided to you. Okay, In this new situation, you will find victory and success, Pisces. You do have the opportunity to meet a person, man or woman, emperor energy here that wants to come in and show you love with the page of cups here. Someone that wants to have a prominent, stable future with you. Someone that is bringing in justice. Someone that's bringing in clarity. Someone that is completely 100% healed. You're not dealing with someone that's coming in with unnecessary baggage. On the contrary, you're coming with... From, with you're coming into union with someone who knows what they want. They know what direction they they want their life to go in, and they know that they want you to be part of that of that circumstance, of that situation, of that direction. This person is bringing in big and stable offers for you, Pisces. You're dealing with someone who, again, a grown, mature individual who knows what they want and they know where they want to go to with the situation. You have the opportunity to once again be happy. After a dark energy, after a dark time, after a lot of deception, you finally are getting that opportunity to have a fresh start, Pisces. And the, this wish fulfillment that you definitely do not see coming towards you, it's going to come in and it's going to make you very, very happy. You're going to feel like is this real? Is this person real? Well, they are as real as they come, Pisces. You deserve this happiness. You deserve this abundance. And it is all becoming available for you. All right, Pisces. I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you are interested in booking a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. You guys have a good one. Take care. Bye.